Hey what's up guys, I'm Kim Bonanno and welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with more Red Dead Redemption 2. So in the last video we made it to chapter 4, so it was quite an eventful video. Sean unfortunately was shot in the face and very much dead. And Jack was kidnapped, Arthur was also kidnapped um, by you O'Driscolls. Yeah, a lot happened and I was very overwhelmed with everything. But today we are starting off in St. Denise. We went there with Dutch. We have three missions. We're going to try and locate Angelo Bronte. And yeah, we're going to explore St. Denise today. I'm very excited. So if you guys are ready, I think we should just get started. Nope, oh, taking a nap. By the harbor? A lot of boats here. Wakey wakey! <laughs> Alright, here we are. Ready to seize the day. Uh, right. Also, first of all, uh, I wanna apologize. I was not even close to you. So you're going through the wall. Maybe you should worry about that a bit more. Um, but I want to apologize because I've been having some mic Hello, issues. Like there would be like a very high pitch noise when I was talking. I'm hoping um, it's better today. Why is there an X? Oh, it wasn't an X. But you're standing right under that. That's Hello, a perfect fit. Um, but I have a new XLR cable and I have tried to re like move the cable a bit more away from some power supply things, so hopefully it's fixed. If it's not, I will cry, but I will um, worry about that later. <gasps> Look at that horse's mane, it's so red. Amazing. Uh, it did say that there was new horse. Oh, the stable's right here. There were new horses available. Yeah, I think today's video is just going to be very chill. Um, and pretty much just... Uh, <laughs> looking at the shops and... That's... We already have one of these. Oh, you'd be wise to buy one from me. Do we still have that one? Oh, we do have an Arabian as well. Tokaman. That's a beautiful color. It's a little bit yellow, isn't it? Almost looks gold. Well. Uh, should we... Mm. I, appreciate it. Day, huh? I think we might as well just Good buy some of this so we have celery. Oof. But sure, if they like that, we'll buy it. It, he wouldn't whistle for a second. I was like, huh? All right. Now we did arrive in this town. Before. Um, but we haven't really explored it. So. Hey there, partner. Howdy, sir. Fuel you... and supply. Look at it. Smoke. Oh that does not look very good for the environment, but. <laughs> Ooh, so there's a little uh, park. Oh, this is nice. You can fish here? Hmm. 
That reminds me, I still need to find the mission so we can get the legendary bait or whatever. The... I don't know if you call it bait. The lures. Lures? Lures. Whatever. <laughs> Something along those lines. But, um... I'm sure we'll find it eventually. Hello. Howdy. Huh. Now what is that? Cornwall Station. Hmm. Don't think they'll like us in there. Stranger mission? We might do stranger missions. I'm not sure though. Oh, there is. Hmm. Although I do want to have like look around in the streets a bit. What are they doing? Hey, fellas. <laughs> Country boy thinks he can hack it and sit. Say what you now? Good place, get some food. I don't know. Hey, hey you! You ain't supposed to be here. Oh, don't mind me. Got caught in the ears? Get out! Now, that ain't too civil, friend. This ain't necessary. Leave me be. <laughs> you started it. <laughs> Gentlemen. Hello. All right then, better not remember this tomorrow. Me too. Mm. Mm. Is that the police station? I just see an officer. See another one over there. Okay. Well, there's like a bounty poster in there, so it could be. Is he here now? Where? Gavin! Where is he? This guy? I, I, I'm looking for my mate Gavin. Somebody help me! Gav? Gav? I've lost my friend. Somebody help me, please! What? Evening. Please, tell me you've seen Gavin. I don't even know what he looks like. Big bloke. Cockney. Londoner. Hilarious. <laughs> oh, we've had such times, me and Gav. <laughs> no, sorry. I've yet to meet any hilarious Londoners. Oh, he's the best. Gavin! Go back it. Oh, I am so worried. Gav. So from Gav. what? I... Uh, Gav. Gav. Where are you? But what I could understand on you guys, you? Gavin can't be found in the game. And then there's been speculation on if he's mentally ill, this guy, or something. I don't know. Ugh. I am so worried. Hey there. Hello. Hello, sir. Sir. Hey, evening, mister. Oh, his, his voice scared me. We fit right through. Let's go. <laughs> what do we have? Staves? Something? It's an office? Uh. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I'm not too. What's that? That looks a bit weird. Oh well. Yeah, I just love the whole vibe of this place. It's so. Well. Um, just what is the matter? Sorry, with you? sorry. Good evening. So modern <laughs> compared to like the rest of uh, the world, and it's so alive. Go in. Can we go in? Well, hello. Hello. Evening, sir. Take it for one, please. Make your way through the doors on either side of me. All right. Thank you. It front row, folks. I'm gonna tell you a Hello. morality tale Ladies. from when our country was young. But the settlers used to tell about the woods of Massachusetts and the creatures that lived there. One summer, a bear was by the stream. <laughs> the an old man wind appeared and said, Bear, I shall blow a mighty cold upon the land and gorge yourself on fish and meat and go find a den. Then sleep, not for one night, but for sixty. Go tell all the animals of the forest what I have told you. Bear was sad because the fish were his friends, oh. <laughs> and now he had to eat them. But he knew to do whatever the wind told him. The animals of the forest often teased Bear and said he was slow and lazy and foolish for listening to old man wind. You're talking to the wind again, eh? Laughed the rabbit. I think Bear has finally taken leave of his senses, said the turtle, and he's getting so rotund that even I could outrun him. I'm smart and quick, said Rabbit. I'll outrun Old Man Wind if he comes a-calling, or you, since you're into eating your friends, the turtle said. If Wind comes, I'll just hide in my shell. Then Bear went and warned Coyote and Possum that they should prepare for a long, cold winter. It's so hot, said the coyote. There's plenty of time. The lazy possum said, well, There's an abundance of food. Maybe I'll just store some in my pouch. Even his squirrel friends made fun of Bear. They laughed and laughed and squibbled and squabbled. Chunky needs a nap. Fatty Goody Two-Shoes does what he's told. Bear was very sad. But he was a good bear, and he always did what Old Man Wind told him. He went and found a den, snuggled inside, and fell fast asleep. This is so cute. Bear snored and snored for many days. When he woke up, he saw spring had come. He was very hungry, so he walked outside. As the snow melted, he saw all his friends who hadn't listened frozen and just ready to be eaten. And that's why the bear hibernates. So listen to your elders and do just what you're told. Well, that took a dark turn. Jeez. But I guess lesson learned. Thank you. Hope it was a good show. Uh, sure. Senor. Let's go, girl. We'll say it was. A music house. Big loss of 
had to leave the biggest pocket. Can we? Hey, mister! Don't think we can go in there? No. Hello! Hi! Toys and fancy goods. I don't even know where to look. Hmm. I guess it's not really making it easier that it's dark. What's this? This looks fancy. I think we've been here. Let's see. Okay, let's go past the police station then. Oh, there's another theater. Theater. <laughs> Sounded weird. Big high class. Oh, we can play dominoes over there. There, girl. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, damn! Fancy transportation. Spawn. <laughs> oh my god. Hello. Hi. Okay there. Wow. These houses. Look amazing. Bye. E. Make, attention. Make attention. Make <laughs> attention. It's like a cute little park. I love it here. Can we live here? Please? Hi there, mister. How are you? <laughs> oh, it's nice. Go up the stairs. I mean, it's it's a small park, but it's adorable. like no sense of direction right now it's weird where are, where are we okay <laughs> um should probably go on a bit more myth Hello. hey park hey, <laughs> Hey there! Need something? No, I'm just looking. Love the architecture. Architecture, it's amazing. Hello. Hey. Hey, friend. 
<sighs> that one looks a bit like a Sims house, doesn't it? Is that like a little garage? Come on. Oh, not that exit. Sean. I guess we're making... Oh, wait, that's not where I thought we were. Huh. Hmm. Should we put a waypoint, like, up here, then we can explore, like, this road down? Because I'm all turned around. Like, this is so disorienting. That looks fancy. Hmm. Morning. Ah, no time again. <laughs> eh. <laughs> All right. I also saw a lot of you saying that Arthur is not eat eating; he's snacking. And I can see you guys' point. So maybe. Have to go hunting a little bit. Cook some meat. Make him meat. Oh my God. Is this like the rich neighborhood? I can't really. Like, look at that. My goodness. A huge mansion. Fine morning, partner. Oh. Hey there, mister. I see the clothing store is here somewhere. Up the stairs, up the stairs. Go. What's the matter with you? Go. Go. <laughs> oh, that's a good girl. Yeah. yeah. I see that we're close to a mission. Oh, look at the statue. God. Bonjour. Bonjour. Hmm. Oh, the store's open. I want to see if they have like some fancy clothes. Wouldn't that be fun? Looks like a fancy store. Oh Hello. my goodness. Good to have you. Yeah, we've not. Ooh, a back booty. <laughs> no, it's just a dress. Um, yeah, we've not been in a place like this before, that's for sure. Let's have a look here. Let me see your finished outfit. Ooh! Oh no. I don't think I'm ready to see Arthur in anything like this. Um. I stand behind everything I sell in this place, so you can purchase with confidence. I do like the purple. I do like the purple. I think I was expecting more, not gonna lie. But I mean, that one is quite fancy. It is. 
I mean, this one without... If you have any questions, you just let me know. Without the hat is also good. But then I like that one more. Let's get this one. Oh, that's beautiful. And we, we are changing the hat, though. Because um, I'm not a fan of that. I have plenty more greater. Not sure. Yeah, we probably Items. need to go to the to the horse to change it. Good yeah. Merci. Well, happy days. Oh, I love her dress. More so the hat, Hello. though. How are you today? Hello. Girl. This one. <laughs> Hi. How you doing today? Hello. Hello. It's Hello been there. a fine few days. Do I just lose that hat then? I don't know. Probably not. We I mean we did buy it, so I think we're should be good. A little bit difficult to see some anything here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> bonjour. Bonjour. Have anything you can spare for a blind man? Oh, oh, is someone there? Um, Always for the blind. Buenos dias. Hello. Okay, I'm just gonna give him money. I'm gonna... Oh, thank you, sir. Uh, truly, thank you. It means a lot to me. Yeah. I usually don't want to check if they're blind or not, but... I already did! So you getting along okay? Oh yeah, it's, this town is so much better when it's light outside. I think this is like a main road, maybe. Um, I do want to go to the hair salon, so let's actually. I think also the doctor is down here. Ooh, not that, not that face. Ooh, what is that? Deposit? Is it a bank? Could very much look like a bank. Good lord. Shop printing. Books. Job. Card and something. <gasps> Should we uh, go visit the doctor? He did say he, he had like a reward for us or something? Later? I'm not sure. We can go and see. He ah, recognizes first visit us. here, I believe, sir. Joseph Barnes. If you try the cocaine gum there, take my advice. Start with only a little bit. Okay, he does not recognize us. Is that chocolate? 
He's got candy. Well. Thanks, partner. Gotta go down this road. What are you doing? It calm down. Watchmaker. Good morning. Hello. Good morning, mister. Morning, my friend. Good morning. Cafe Mark Markhand open daily. March a mark. Oh, hello. Oh. Mrs. Donovan selling a wagon. She says she's selling for a good deal, but I can buy two wagons at that price. We need a haircut. Please help me. <laughs> so, what do you need? Let's see what he can do for us. Lip. Arthur, why is your hair so long all of a sudden? Is this... Is it that long? Really? Why is it so long, Arthur? Come on, friend. What can I do for you? I do like his middle part. Makes a man look ten years younger. It does. My god. Uh, what about your facial hair? Is there... Full styles? Clean shape. Mustache style. Pencil. <laughs> Chin. <laughs> Can't barely see it. Sideburns. Lord. Yeah, no, we are um I think we're gonna just get rid of it. Now that isn't half bad, huh? Ooh, 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 ooh. Treating our man right today. Haircut, new Please, outfit. Tell your friends oh about us. If we please you tell others if we don't tell us. Makes my heart Thanks, Mister. Indeed. Morning, Mister. That is. A, I really like that sign. Actually, well, haven't worked in in retail. Could not agree anymore. Good morning, Mister. Good morning. Howdy, y'all. Um. What else is there? Oh, there's a stranger mission. We could go and do that. Although, what's this? A photo studio? I kind of want to go see that first then. That's because we haven't seen that before. We're done. Oh, look at that! Studio portraits. Yes, yes. Welcome, sir. I do love a first timer. A first timer. Yeah, let's get a portrait. Why not? <laughs> you possibly. Uh... Take my photograph. Oh uh, no. Pose? <gasps> Give me a pose and don't be shy. Yeah, give us that. Good. Can I zoom in? Oh, we can't change the background. <laughs> Why not? 
Cat, you are the focus here. Oh, I have. I just. In my there eye. There are actually bordellos around here we could go to if, if you prefer. It's five dollars. Thank you. I hope it turns out looking somewhat human. <laughs> yes. Now, pose for me something comfortable. Comfortable. <laughs> oh my god. Arthur. Arthur, Arthur, Arthur. Give <laughs> me a pose and don't be shy. Yeah, boy. Can you smile? <laughs> Hope it ain't as bad as I fear. <laughs> okay, let's change the pose again. Yes, okay. now. That's what we have. Something comfortable. I do like him with the coffee. <laughs> it has been captured. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Thank you, kite sir. Easy now, partner. Thanks, this, partner. Okay, there we go. Oi. Sorry. What? What am I? What you think you do? I don't know. Come on. Sorry about that. Something is seriously irritating my eye. Like it feels like I have an eyelash or something in my eye, but I cannot see anything. So it's like one second it's fine, and then the other second it's. I can't see anything. That's the struggle with wearing makeup because it can't rub my eye. Okay. Let's go to the stranger mission. Obviously there is probably so much to discover in this town. So, um... doing here sure less than a minute I promise uh, we're trying to raise money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall a shelter for homeless veterans and their families can you help a donation of $20 would put us well on our way sure Twenty dollars ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. That's very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will be acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. Aww. I could also loot the box. Okay, girl. Wouldn't that be pretty? Alright, well, wasn't really that much to it. Um, what to do next? What to do next? Hmm. I mean, we could go and pay off our bounty. Um. We do that at the post office, but let's make our way to the gunsmith. Because a lot of you have pointed out that we could just upgrade, How are you today? upgrade and customize our weapons. So let me go and do that. No. 
What you get when you cross me? Another soul going down to hell. What did I just see? I didn't do anything. Just having a bit of fun, all right? You might not have thought that through. What did? What did I do? Nothing. Oh. There goes my eye again. Holy crap! Sorry. Mister? Hey, partner. Oh. Hmm. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Oh, laundry. Weather couldn't be any better. Welcome to Cao Chow. I don't think I've seen you here before. Sir? You haven't. I can see you look after your firearm. Would you be interested in me changing some of the parts at all? Is it already fully upgraded? You got no regrets with that decision. You will feel the difference right away. Styles. <gasps> Middles. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Gold and silver. Brass. I am a brass girl. Gonna lie. Let's go full brass. You won't find a better selection of firearms this side of the river. Kind of looks bad, but okay, we'll take it. Take your time. Go for that. Maybe I should have chosen a smaller store in Chinatown. Something cheaper. But I'm sure things will turn around. See, 
I know little to nothing about guns, so... Oh. We also offer an engraving service in case you are interested. Really now? Hmm. Wait, I do really like the owls. How are you? Looks cool. I hope this store will bring more people to Chinatown, but I am still waiting. Ooh. I do like that one. Customized a little bit, then um, you can always do some <laughs> more in the help. future. Hi there. Hello. Yeah. Okay. Well, it has been quite a bit. It's probably been an hour or something. So uh, let's actually go and do uh, a mission. I could imagine, since there's like three of these, that they're not necessarily going to. What the hell? I just got this shirt. I've been covered in worse, friend. <laughs> just had to be me. Did she know him, or was it just an accident? Senor. All right. Oh wait, the bar is closed. So can we not do this? Stick him up, cowboy. Hey, Dutch. Suppose it's all right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, real funny, Dutch. <laughs> oh, I thought so. So, here we are of course you in did. a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. And from what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I'm always cool. I'll meet you back here or not. Certainly fit oh, yeah, in. You know how it is. I told him. I say that's the state of Lamorne for you, America's dirty little French secret. <laughs> that's why we love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'm a transplant, but I'm never leaving. Not unless we all get washed away. <laughs> Hello. Every year they say that's gonna happen. It ain't happened yet. <laughs> I'll get you in a second. Let me tell you something. The rest of the states they lucky to have us. If it wasn't for us, they'd probably have run back to Britain with the tails between their legs at the first sign of trouble. You got that right. Now, how can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Sure. Dollar, please. For a whiskey? Oh, that's the real stuff. From a scholar. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, thank you. So, mister, if I ask you a question, you ever hear of a fella by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, 
I don't know what business you in, but leave it, friend. You and your pal that was in here before. That went well. Bronte? Angelo Bronte? Mr. Big, Mr. Italian, spaghetti eating, long streak of piss big. <laughs> yeah, he makes my skin crawl. I'm so squally a cocksucker. You know what I mean, friend? Where can I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you can talk to them kids in the alley. They'll know how I get. In the oh, alley? Hey, friend, you, you be careful now. Immigrants, they're not to be trusted. Um, can we exit from here? Maybe not. Okay, I'm gonna go out and around. Huh. Really? We're asking kids? How'd they know? Unless you're troublemakers. to any man with a ring on his finger and turn it three times? Yes! And then after 24 men find any married person, male or female, wearing a wedding ring, turn that ring twice, and then the next man you shake hands with will become your husband. What nonsense. Don't take my word for it then. Hey! Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. This bad news. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What it'll cost. I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where does he live, New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, I'm going to rob him. That's my bread. Here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? Stay close. Easy to get lost around here. Come on, then. You new to the city, mister? Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows it as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? I hate Hope kids. you won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. That's Baird and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now over here's a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, mister. Modeled on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You been to Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama said they used to burn Protestants and all, but, uh... Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine steeples. Hey, hey, I knew it. I knew it. Get going. He's coming after us. Get back here. I don't think I'm so You give that back. Oh my god. Oh god. Should I have gotten on my horse? Shine, what was that? I don't know. Bash around so much. 
much. Couldn't even read the newspaper. Remember when they had to bring the mules wait, wait. back wait. out after the snow? Come on, keep up. Oh, there he was. Hey, moron! Sorry. Get back here, you little. Bye, Go, go. Come on, run like the goats got loose. Stop, little shit. Just give it up, farm boy. You better stop right now. You got strange voices in your head, don't you? You ain't got ah! a chance in Ow. My angles. Just give it up, kid. What was yeah. all this running for? <laughs> Go, oh, Arthur. Search the Watch yourself. Excuse me. You some kind of joker, huh? I am. Hello, I'm man. Telling you, a cucumber is definitely so a Since when? Since forever. I read in the newspaper. Oh. So it must Where did he go? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Hello. Arthur. Oh my god, okay, he did not want to go over it. Mm. Mm. What's the problem, friend? Give me my thanks, boy. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend, but that kid is, and he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. That kid was gonna show me before he robbed me. <gasps> Ow. <laughs> Come on! You new in town, mister? Come on. Give me my Bronte's stuff. got a lot of friends, mister, but I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. <laughs> you don't like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. Oh my god. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just want to speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. He been mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. <laughs> well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's I, got it pisses me off they're calling us mister all the time. Park. Hey, yokel. Now, get out of here. to give me my stuff back thank the lords that was a lot of money i could have lost right there is there another beggar i thought about Getting on my horse again when he was riding the whack or the. What do you call that? The ele electric train? <laughs> I don't know. Um, but. Pretty sure I wasn't supposed to. So. Okay, Noah's having a tough time figuring out our location, I guess. Okay, it's right here. Bitch! There you are, girl! You did a good job. Morning. So where... Is he over there? I saw you! Good day. Where you been? Getting robbed? Who by? <laughs> Bunch Kids. of children. <laughs> I won't inquire anymore. But I found Mr. Bronte. Seems to be some Italian Mr. Big in town. Everybody knows him, but nobody wants to talk about him. Apparently lives in a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Huh. 
Good work. So what now? We go pay him a visit. I'll get John, you meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. Hmm. Well, we do need to get Jack back, that's for sure. I cannot decide which I like less. The swamps or the city. Both are full of parasites, reptiles, and slime. <sighs> We're a long way each to land we know, and far from real open country. Oh, wait. Oh. Wait, what? So, was there three missions available? <laughs> did it matter which one you picked, or did I just get lucky and pick? Well, I guess we'll never know. <laughs> oh. Oh, wait. Strauss. And Mary Beth. Someone is in trouble here. Okay, I... I do want to go and explore the town a little bit more, and... I feel like... Obviously, it's not really going to be possible for me to see everything, like the first time we go here, but... I do think maybe if we go to some of these stranger missions, that we'll get to see a bit more of this part of town of this part of town so we could try and do that um see what that is about and then i'm thinking that once we head back to camp we could do the strauss mission it's probably you know money collecting again um so we'll probably have to go somewhere to collect some debt but we'll see So Is the train coming? Uh oh. Gotta move. Okay. So you can definitely tell there is a uh, there's some different neighborhoods in this town. I think this is like the poor the poor part of part of town. <laughs> that was a tongue twister. Yeah, compared to uh, the houses we saw on the other street. Like, I would not sit on that balcony. Looks like it's about to give up. But there's also no support underneath it, so... Oh my goodness, he just... collapsed. Gentlemen. Good morning, sir. Hello, Good morning. Mr. Hold up, okay, I hope. Mister? Morning, fella. Hey, mister. Morning. My goodness. Yeah, well, anyway. I don't know, to me, something like this is... I mean, obviously this was a very long time ago, but also... I know you don't see, like, places like this and... All over the world, but... In Denmark, I don't think... From t to my knowledge, you don't find something... Uh, whatever that was. Like this. And I guess that's a good thing. Ah, excuse me, bud. Hello. 
something wrong or what? You okay, mister? Well, well. Hey there, mister. Hello. What? <laughs> Listen, bit of a weird question, but do you know where I might find some moonshine? What? Moonshine. You know, strong liquor. Over strong. Wow, you want to get over drunk? <laughs> no, no, it's not for drinking. <laughs> what is it for? Oh, I just need some. Well, as luck would have it, you are in the legal hooch capital of America. Ooh. There's plenty of real booze here. <laughs> but for shine, well, I'm guessing you need to go out into the woods. I mean, I know you'd have to go out into the woods. Now listen, I don't need that much. How much? About a hundred gallons. Of shine? Yes, thereabouts. Why? Yeah, that's not a lot at all. Right, I'm trying. I'm building a machine. A machine of love. <laughs> Hundreds of gallons of hooch and love's gonna come pretty cheap. Please, friend. I'll pay. Just, just, just bring it here. It's for a good cause. Well, if anyone knows who's moving that kind of shine, it'll be that stagecoach guy in Rhodes. Oh. Talk to all the oh that's cool how they kind of intertwine like that i like that okay <laughs> we're gonna go and pay off our bounty uh from this place in case we accidentally go up there eventually um oh can i not do this now why I don't know if we should just go past the others because it stranger missions a lot of them well at least some of them have been just collectibles and stuff like that only a few of them have been where we start the mission immediately so and we haven't methanol Um, and it's not like we've done much, we've just, you know, been walking around, looking at things, and I mean, I'm fine with that, just seeing everything, or a lot what this place has to offer, and uh, getting a feel for, for the place, you know? As a grocery, wines and liquors, so general store. Just a little bounty, fellas. Hey there. Hello, Morning. I hear music. Like a violin. Look at her go. Oh. Um. I see. <laughs> oh well, you just see yourself. Hey, folks. They just look at me. Nice people around here. I remember when I was younger, I thought playing the violin was like the coolest thing ever, and there was nothing more I wanted to do, but. I've never touched a violin, <laughs> but I thought it was just so cool. Hello there. Madam. She is jamming. Give me some space, please. Sorry. Just admiring your talent. Howdy. Hello, hmm. mister. Sorry. Hey, careful now. Yeah, yeah. No worries. No worries. Okay, my girl. <laughs> There's some serious, amazing details on these houses. That's incredible. Just some things you don't really see. 
nowadays. A dog. And just uh, like the railing up there, s it looks so good. I'm looking at the most random stuff I know, but it's the de it's in the details, right? There's soup kitchen over here. How do you enter this place? Here? Ales, wines, cigars. Hey, fellas. Hey, buy me a drink, mon ami. Mon ami. <laughs> sure, what you want? Brandy. Two brandies, bud. It's two dollars a glass. Oh, better be good then. Mm. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. Quite a country you're building here, eh? Well, me personally? Hmm? I don't know. What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. <laughs> How very American of you. I love it. <laughs> what do you That's do? Oh, mostly I, I pose, I show off, I complain. Oh, how very friend. I know. <laughs> I am ridiculous. <laughs> I have been all over the world. I have seen the sights, and I have discovered the one eternal truth that I am a pies. Um, how do you say? All ass. Mm. Asshole. Mm. That too. That too. <laughs> mm. Well, at least you have some self knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? Mm. All the civilized world, painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No. I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, mm. but you paint. Not according to the salons at Paris. No, according to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Hmm, that smelly, filthy place with old buildings and ghosts and shit and French people. I have that right here. <laughs> I guess so. Hmm, you know, uh... Arthur. Charles, you know Arthur? Don't believe in art. Hmm. It's lies. Believe in women. They are the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina, that is truth. Breasts <laughs> is truth. Art is for idiots. You say so. Oh Trust my me, god. I tried both. One is better. <laughs> Much better. <sighs> so, I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but, here. What is it? Uh, it's just a little doodle. Uh, you know, Oops. entirely worthless, unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's very kind, Charles. Mm, no matter. Good meeting you. Mm. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Wait. That was it? To finish the bottle, are we? Hello. Where'd he go? Is he gone? He disappeared. Hello. Oh yeah. Hello. <laughs> I don't even know the melody. It just worked. <laughs> Well, that was, um, fun. Hello. I hope we can meet him again somewhere. We probably can. But yeah, I love how some of them are not even, like, missions. They're just, you know, meeting people. And I love that. Just different characters and... You, kind sir. Will you help the poor? I can't. Um. Why not? We're closed. Until when? I don't know right now. This isn't right. Look, well, I'm sorry. Sir? I'm doing everything I can. 
Hey. You just don't like Chinese What's your goddamn people. problem? You won't see any more of my money. It's only temporary. This will all be sorted out soon, I promise. Hey. What's going the on now? The whole saloon's overrun with rats. I'm losing business left and right. I need to get someone to get rid of them for me. I'll pay very well. I just need it done. All right, calm down. Let me see what I can do. Oh, thank God. Just be sure not to bang around the place too much. I'll wait out here. Locate and kill rats in the... How am I gonna... With what? Uh... Am I not allowed to shoot? Oh, Jesus. Maybe I just don't destroy too many things, maybe. Where'd you go, buddy? I'm really sorry if there's a lot of pausing in this video, but I think there's some new people who moved in where I live and Ooh, Thanks, mister. Take this. Who earned every cent. They're making a lot of holes in the wall. I killed worse. <laughs> Thank you. Hey there, girl. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm sorry about it. It's awful in there. I'm sorry. Yeah, they. I think they got a lot of stuff to hang up on the walls or something because hey, they are sir? drilling away. So. I show kind. Yes, you are, sir. You have it in you. I can tell. I'm a nasty bit of work, father. Oh. Wrong on two counts, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. You may have made some some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? Why is he kind of good looking? You have no idea. But you do. And God does. And that's enough for me and for him. We shall see. That we shall, sir. But why don't you hedge your bets and give two bits to the poor? There are so many who will go hungry tonight. Fine. Sure. They got so much money. Bless you, sir. How you getting on, anyhow? These are a somewhat apathetic lot, I'm afraid. Mm. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. That's a wonderful insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. <laughs> well, sometimes he's a downright fool, but, well, usually he's the best man I know. That's wonderful. The, the thing is, I'm, well, poverty will always be with us. But slavery, I, I thought we had banished that. But Sandini is acting as a staging post for shipping slaves out to some of the islands. I don't believe you. It's 1899. Maybe you should take a look for yourself. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner, the one with the green door, well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Oh my Help good God. Floor. Really? I'd really appreciate it if you take a look. Wait, we only give, gave the guy five cents? We could have given him more. Sir, to do a Hello. Shopping. How'd you do? What shop? Okay. Hello. In here? Is it the fence? Really? Search for clues of captives. 
Hi there, mister. Uh, feel free to browse. Shall do. What? Looking for anything in particular? Um... Got a few paintings over there. Uh, something for the wife, maybe? Oh yeah, definitely. You timed it well. Some quality pieces in at the moment. Hmm. Oh. Well, you just let me know if I can. Oh. Help. Oh, uh, nothing much back there. I'm afraid. Just a few old books. Something don't seem right. Sir, uh, what are you doing? Who's back, back there? here? Looks like this pulls out or something. Pulls out? No, it's just an old bookcase. Uh, seen better days. How about you open that door? Door? What door? The hidden door. Or I'll open the hidden door in your chest. They made me do it. I, I was always good to them, but they, they forced me to do it, sir. I, I swear. Open the door. Now. Oh, okay, okay. Just pull the big red book on the bookshelf. It's called The Scourge of Crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. Open the fake bookcase. Red book, red book. Oh. That one. Okay. running Ooh. oh oh hello oh. oh god can i not hello hi 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 por favor ayúdanos Oh Help, no. Help, please. What the hell is wrong with people? Now don't worry. I'm on your side. Hmm. Por favor. I know it was normal. It's gonna be at okay. some point, but like still, how can you look at people in that way? It's Gracias, disgusting to me. Come with me. Don't worry. You're gonna be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. You'll be safe soon. This way. Not much farther. Poor oh. bastards. Cat. The kitty. I feel like this place is cursed. It is. Where's the other guy going? Oh. Welcome back, sir. Oh, we can run. Okay, there we go. Oh, he was right. Brother, brother Dorkin's friend, Arthur, Arthur Morgan. Come on, you were right. I found these two imprisoned in that shop. Oh my, that's well. They are blessed to have met you, Arthur. Trust me in that. They're very unusual. I don't think they speak much English. My brothers, come. Let's go get something to eat. Manger, comida, please. Hey, he forgot this. Oh, yes. Thank you. I, uh, here, payment for your services. I could not have freed these men myself. Give it to the poor, brother. Thank you. I will. Like I said, magnificent. Don't come on, it. come, come, come. Come see me again sometime. I often work at the old church on Gasper Street in St. Francis. All right. I don't know how much money there were in the tray, but if it was just our own money to get back, it's like a... Don't... Come 
really need it. Alright. Well. Uh, we're gonna go pay our bounty at the post office. And then I think we're gonna head to Rhodes. And if we have time, let's go and do the Strauss mission. I just hope it doesn't turn out that the priest is is evil or something. That'll feel really bad. And I don't know if any of you guys are wondering or anything, but I'm not religious in any shape or form. I don't really believe in that stuff, so... I don't care if he's a priest or not. If if they're a good person, they're a good person, you know. <laughs> yeah, be a little bit of a troublemaker. Okay, then, girl. All right, to roads, are we go. Although I am a bit worried about having to rob those um. Stage coaches. Oh, wait. Something new just popped up. Brother Dorkins. Oh. Okay. All right then. Lots of stranger missions to do, and I'm kind of all for it. Sometimes it's really difficult to see some anything for because of the sun, but it's so good. Ain't been too many federals coming through. But I got some horse heads. Go, go, go. Also need to get Arthur some food. Make sure he eats. I why do I keep Hello? I don't wanna drink the moonshine, but he just last second it changes. I guess this is when I have to release the thing too. I mess it up, but... Hello. Oh well. And maybe we can run into the the horse lady again with the race. See if we can uh, beat her again. Although I feel like it's very quick that we can go into roads again. 
But um, we'll see what the people have to say when we return. I'm not sure they're going to be too pleased. Place. I got away, but they got my wife. Please, mister. I gotta do something. All right. Where is she? It's a sack down in the swamp by the water. <laughs> okay. Go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Oh. Uh, I go about finding more help. Is it the little. Oh, uh oh. I have a bad feeling about this. Well, I hate this place. I really do. I am so scared of gators. Oh god. I feel like I can't really stray from the path. Guess we will run. I was not ready for that. Jesus Christ. Oh no. Should have went with a different... Should not have picked the rifle. Should not have picked the rifle. That sucks. Oh well. What can we do about it? Oh! Oh, that was a bit deeper than I thought it was. Well. Got stabbed yeah. right in the heart, didn't we? Shoo! Yeah, I should have just... Okay, went in with the pistols. Because I, I didn't really think there was going to be multiple people. I don't know why. Easy there, girl. How does you? Hello. Hey, mister. Maybe we can get something similar in the future, like simple, a simple, a similar encounter. I don't know. Feels so bad. I just know that that woman is dead. God damn it. Well, that's gonna bug me the rest of the video. I can already tell. Oh well. You live and you learn. Oh, you're dying, you die and you'll learn, I guess. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> Look at the dog. Look at them. Hey, oh. mister. Evening, mister. So cute. <laughs> Are we really not wanted here anymore? Like... I feel weird being back. I really do. Oh wait, is there... Oh, there's a stranger mission. Oh, there's so much now. Oh. 
First off, let's uh, go to the station. With that whack in. I just hope one day there's going to be a person behind the Good door evening, and sir. just slam them into him. Glad you dropped in. I've got that uh, information you asked for. Yeah. Um, I need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. I knew I picked the right feather to speak to. Inspect a note from his session to find out details. The robbery. Bridge in Blue Water, Mar Blue Water Marsh, north of Saint Denis. Look for a wagon coming south. It should be carrying a load of moonshine bottles in the bag. Drive careful with it. Okay. Is it gonna tell me? Um. Oh no. Oh, wait, here? Professor. Okay. Thank the lords. Mm. Okay, should we go to the stranger mission since we're in the area? My god, there's so much to do all of a sudden. I almost feel overwhelmed. What's in here? Oh. Oh, okay. Come on, girl. It's just because the other place is quite far where we need to rob it, so... Since we're in this area, and before I forget about the mission... Oh. Oh. You're leaving me, huh? So, yeah, we'll leave this there! Oh god. What's happening? Are they fighting? <laughs> hey fellas, what you doing? What you fools up to? It's Mr. Black's fault. His fault to Darky White. Oh, I don't know why they call him that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. And I'll tell you, you lily livid. Enough. Huh. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what of it? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's okay. You and for a darkie. Shut it, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had up to here with you. Enough. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. Okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start <laughs> up again. Just <laughs> shut up. You shut up! Uh, to stop bounty hunter searching for Mr. Black and Mr. White. Okay. So, do I? Okay, guess we just have to to go and look <laughs> with our eyes. Okay, are they going to be marked? Bounty posters. Where would they put them? And how would I know when I've gotten all of them? Oh! Hey, move! I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? Bounty hunting bastard! Stop! I'm gonna end you! Your Stop. days are over, you son of a bitch! No damn- At least hit me properly. <coughs> no damn manners. This is what you wanted? Stop. Stop. 
You ain't the law, you know. Uh, oh my god, good. I gave you a chance to back off. Next time, avoid me. Don't mind me. All right. Hmm. Both considered dangerous. Hmm. Okay, there's five. Worse than worse. Yo, it was one for gossip. Hey, Jeff throw me some escape thieves. Got posters all over town. If you'd like to help. Every fool knows the charge. Mr. Lawman. A fellers missing. Got posters up all over town. Mm. He died of a heart attack. Nonsense. And Samson Black was set up. Everyone knows Judge Amory. Uh. You don't believe that, do you? Sure. And you call me a gossip? I like how everything just back to normal. But we did also kill a lot of people. Okay, that's three. I feel like this last two are going to be I don't difficult. think you got any idea about the land you walk in, do you? What us raiders gave for it. Mr. I need that poster. There's been a recall. I weren't born yesterday. This one's mine, so you can go and get your own. Girl. We gotta do. Oh no, you don't. Oh yes, I do. Get this off of me. You dirty bastard. You go. So help me God, you give that back. I won't. <laughs> Bye. Meeting you. <laughs> Maybe down this street. I don't know. Maybe by the station. Trying to just keep a lookout on the mini map. Um. Oh, it's always the last one, isn't it? Is it further out of town? What's going on now? I didn't mean oh, to kill him. Sir, thank you. How I even managed to stay faithful to that goddamn psychopath as long as I did. Out of his mind. You should get out of here. I'm sure this attracted some attention. You all right, um, girl? Um, I, okay. Well, we did kill him. Not that it was intentional. Those boys was mine. Oh, you still okay? You still um broken free. No mm. oh, poster. 
Is it in here? <gasps> yes. Hello again, sir. Thank God. Ugh, I did it. Still on time. Something else? I've been waiting on I thought it would be weird if they didn't have at least around the station, but yeah. Obviously the last one would be a bit more hit. We did it! I mean, you guys are quite easy to find if they really were searching hey, for friend. you. Hello. How was in town? Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you boys. It is so unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. It was a murder. It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. He... I don't like to say. Well... Ain't no business of mine. Here's the posters. Thanks, partner. That's that, then. <sighs> That's that. Free at last. Free from you, at least. Well, not quite. No? We should wait a while first, see if anyone's on our trail. You're right. Too risky to split up now. Two sets of eyes is better than one. This ain't permanent, though. It's a temporary measure. Well, right, right, till things blow over. Then I'm done with you, Black. I'm counting the hours, White. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Um, let's go back to camp, see how everyone is doing, and then we can talk to Strauss. And see what kind of debt we're collecting this time. Yeah. At least try. Yeah, yeah. Easy, easy. Oh. That is burnt to the ground. Love to see it. Wait, is there... Should we try and... Okay. Maybe we don't try and go over there. I don't know. Yep. We won't know if we don't try. Ooh. Is there still people here? Jump! Good job. went down with the house holy smokes wait there are actually guards like the guy over there Shit. I don't expect that I did not but what about the over here. Is she still in there? Wait. Where 
seems to give me. Why is there still guards here? Like, you don't have an employee. I guess, I don't know. still in here. I can't see her better with the first person. Someone told me I could that, but I I know. Shit. Yeah. I think someone mentioned that the Braithways, they are called um Well I think is it the Greys that call them inbreds or something? And she is a result of that. So they've just, you know, hidden her away, banished her. It's, it's sad. It really is. Guy. Yay! I can't remember his name. Hey friend. Hello there. Would William. you be able to help me out again? I could use some assistance gathering herbs for my studies. I can try. What are you looking for this time? Uh, you see this purple flower here? This is sage. But I'll need to experiment with more of it before I can be sure of its effects. I found this one with his friends in the woods. I'd check wooded areas for more. I already got some. Let's try this. Hmm. Oh, yes. I feel ready to take on the world. I'll have trouble sleeping tonight. A man could go for days on this. You've had some long ones, I'm sure. Some sage may just be what you need. You have earned something for all your help this time. Thanks, friend. It's taken me years to develop with innumerable benefits to your senses and spirit. Save it for a special occasion. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be getting back to my studies. I look forward to our next meeting, traveler. Me too. You take care now. Um, I think I've forgotten to check if we have give you health experience. Okay. Stamina experience. Oh, we're drunk. Oh, we're hammered. <laughs> Do 
Do we have anything for that eye? Oh my god, I'm gonna be so sick. Yep. <laughs> like how he's a little bit... He's leaning a little bit. Oh, house. So now. Let me go in there. You had enough, Pa. Enough? All I had enough of is you. Why is he crouched like this? No, no. Why are we? Why? It's like he's going... No. I don't wanna... If it's... Yeah. I don't wanna go in and then robbing people and since there's people in there that's literally what they think I'm going to do if I go in. And just the way Arthur is, looks like he's going into stealth mode and it's like... No. Whoa, huh? easy. Oh. Mountain lion? It's a big cat. Perfect panther pelt. Amazing. Should I bring the carcass? I don't know. I'm going to. A Florida Panther. It's cool. Good haul today, girl. Okay, girl. Yeah. <gasps> There's the boat on the tree. Mining. Who's that? Hey. Oh, it's Karen. I was like, Whoa. good to see you back in one piece. I was like, she's yeah. far away, isn't she, from the camp? Wait. Whoa. Where are we? What does it make it make sense, game? Idiot. Hey, sneeze ball. Look at you. Now that ain't nice. Morning, Arthur. Hey, Molly. Miss O'Shea. So what do you think of this place? Relax. Hey, 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 calm down. Yep. You do enough of it, maybe. Oh. Learn to rob like a gentleman, not a laborer. Well, how do you mean? Having 
get a job in a bank or uh, as a lawyer. Me? Haven't received anything from you in a while, Mr. Morgan. Well, All right. I just never thought I'd... Very Thank good. You. We were getting low. All right. I will. Thank you. Here we go. Just make sure it goes into the pot, not your pop. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. Thank you, Arthur. The face was red like a lobster. A fair hair broke my knob, sir. I was actually a little bit worried since he said take the care in the last video. From a fob, sir. So I thought that he was actually I gone. Get drunk. But it would have been very subtle if it was. It just sounded like he said goodbye when he said take care. It's like, what? <sighs> Think you can make this place work? I can make any place work. Just worried about the boy. Yeah. yeah. Me too. Hey Arthur, I left those arrows by your tent. <gasps> Appreciate it. Thank you, Charles. You okay. Who's playing the guitar? Javier? You're sounding good. Wait, do we actually have a room? Molly. Hello. Watch the wind doesn't change. Oh, shut up, Arthur. Wouldn't want that face to freeze. Whatever you say. I love that we have our own room. <sighs> so cozy. Right there. Um, can't seem to pick them up. Oh well. I uh, haven't really used the bow and arrow, so. We definitely need to get our satchel upgraded. But first, let's go around. And talk to Strauss. You're walking so slowly. Just what is your game? What are you talking about now? You creepy, no good bastard. You think you're really something, <laughs> don't you? You don't fool me one bit. You'll keep. <laughs> Bye, Michael. Trolls. Oh, what was that? A letter.
Letter to Micah from Amos? California. Micah, thank you for your letter. I suppose I'm glad you ain't been hanged yet, but I'm going to have to insist upon you the fact that if I see you, won't well, be no one needs to hang you, as I will break your neck. It ain't that I don't love you, because I do. What with you being my family and all that we done together, and all that we done together, but it's that I am now a family man, as you know. I have daughters, as you know. I swore to the Lord Almighty that I would protect my daughters from all that is evil and wrong in this world. If only he would help me repent of all that I done when we was running together, as you know. And that means repenting of you, as you know, and washing my hands of you. Do not attempt to approach me. Do not attempt to visit me. Do not claim you know me. If I hear you are within 50 miles of me, I will come and find you and then you'll meet your maker and apologize to him on both our behalves. For them things we did. None of this should come to you as news. I was shocked to receive your letter. Do not write to me again. Your brother, Amos Bell. You've burned some bridges, Micah. Even your brother hates you. Sheesh. Mr. Hello. Morgan. Mr. Strauss. Still working, Mr. Strauss. What you been up to? Trying to wrap up our accounts before we leave, Mr. Morgan. So you'll be joining us in Tahiti? I uh, rather fancied Australia. A similar kind of people to us. Lots of opportunity. That tells me we're going to be ranchers. Perhaps, but um, so far we have not raised many cattle. No. So, Mr. Morgan, will you help me finalize our business here? <coughs> this is filthy work. We'll need money in Australia. Uh, for cattle and feed, I mean. Why flinch now? You never have done before. I don't know. Well, here they are. Some fishermen by the name of Davison, Algy Davison, living in a place called Catfish Jackson near Scarlet Meadows. A fisherman. And that's it. We're a union built on that, you know. Yeah. Okay. All right. Individuals is old gang money unmarked on a map. So where is so over here? LG Davidson. Okay. Okay guys, I actually think I'm going to end this video here. Not that we necessarily did that much, in my opinion. We did a few stranger missions. Well quite a bit, now that we think about it. And then we did the one main mission, story mission. Which, I don't know if we just got lucky, and since there was three with Angelo Bronte, that we just picked the right one to start with. I'm not sure though, because there were three others, but I guess we just needed to somewhat locate him, or figure out where he was, or where he operated, or something like that. So I think that's what we have to go and do with Dutch, once we get to that. Um, but I think in the next video we might maybe do the Mary Beth story mission and then we have we do have quite a bit of we have three stranger missions available and I think we'll also go ahead and do those and then we'll see if we have help if we will have time for the one with Dutch um yeah that's what I'm thinking so far and Saint Denise as a city is amazing there's just so much life there and i haven't even seen that much yet and i'm sure there's the place have so much more to offer than what we've seen in this one in this video so yeah i'm excited to just explore it even more i think i was a bit overwhelmed because there's so many like there's the main streets and then you have all the small alleys and you know we, we saw the uh, woman playing the violin in like a secluded area and there's probably a whole lot more stuff to find like that and i'm gonna do my best to see as much as possible while also trying to do a few missions here and there because otherwise we could be exploring forever 
But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'd really appreciate it if you leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. I also stream over on Twitch and you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And if you would like to support my channel even more, you can check out the links in the description down below. That's all for me for now. So bye and take care.